The University of Texas System's annual enrollment period occurs every July. In this video from the Office of Employee Benefits, we'll talk about plan year 2022-2023's annual enrollment. You'll learn about enrollment information, plan updates and enhancements, reminders, and resources. Enrollment Information Annual enrollment begins on July 15th and continues through July 31st. Your benefit changes are effective on September 1st, the beginning of the new plan year. However, benefit changes requiring evidence of insurability will not take effect until the necessary materials are approved. You may complete several tasks during annual enrollment. You can add, update, or remove coverage, change coverage levels, and add or remove dependents and beneficiaries. Your current benefits will roll over to the next plan year if you don't make changes to them. As a reminder, if a retired employee's voluntary coverage is terminated due to non-payment, the election of voluntary coverage during any future enrollment period is prohibited until the non-payment status has been resolved. This applies to dental, vision, voluntary group term life coverage, plus any dependent medical coverage. Please note that re-enrollment in voluntary group term life coverage after resolving non-payment requires resubmitting evidence of insurability. You will retain basic retiree-only medical and basic life coverage because the full cost of that is paid by premium sharing. For more information, please review page 16 of your Annual Enrollment and Resource Guide. Make your enrollment elections in the MyUT Benefits electronic portal. Access it via the web or through the Benefit Place mobile app. Visit utbenefits.link manage for sign-on information and links to the online portal and app. Medical Plan Updates your medical plan faced significant challenges during the COVID-19 pandemic as utilization patterns have fluctuated and overall costs have risen sharply. Premium rate increases were postponed the past two years after consultation with UT institutions, largely to help individuals coping with the challenges of the pandemic. Because your plan is self-funded and relies on monthly premiums to pay the cost of all claims, there will be a premium rate increase for both UT Select and UT Connect medical plans for the 2022-23 plan year. There will also be some plan design changes implemented at this time to help balance out cost share between the member and the plan. These are the first significant plan design changes since 2016, aside from plan design enhancements. As a reminder, with premium sharing from the state in your institution, benefits-eligible retired employees pay no monthly premium for their subscriber-level UT Select or UT Connect medical plan. To see a chart of all plan year 2022-23 premiums, please visit our annual enrollment page at utbenefits.link AE. For more information, please read the letter at the front of your Annual Enrollment and Resource Guide on the Annual Enrollment page. UT Care Medicare PPO Beginning January 1, 2023, Medicare-eligible retired employees and their Medicare-eligible family members enrolled in the UT Select plan will automatically transition from UT Select to the UT Care Medicare PPO plan you must be enrolled in Medicare Parts A and B to participate. Your benefits on UT Care will be equal to or greater than the current UT Select plan. You will receive more information this fall about the medical plan. Plan Design Changes for UT Select For an individual using in-network services, the deductible is now $600, the coinsurance stop loss is $3,500, and the out-of-pocket maximum is $8,700. For a family using in-network services, the deductible is $1,800, the coinsurance stop loss is $3,500 per person, and the out-of-pocket maximum is $17,400. Out-of-network deductibles are higher and continue to have no out-of-pocket maximum. 
Information is available on how to save money by staying within the large Blue Cross Blue Shield of Texas network. All copayments and coinsurance discussed below are specifically for in-network services except for emergency room care, which is the same regardless of network. Primary care physician visit costs do not change. Co-payments for a specialist visit increase to $50 or $40 when visiting a UT Health Network specialist. The co-payment for urgent care increases to $50 per visit. Inpatient and outpatient service co-payments increase, except when receiving services through the UT Health Network. The portion of coinsurance covered by UT Select remains the same this year. The emergency room cost is moving from a copay and coinsurance model to a simplified $500 all inclusive cost per visit. If you are admitted, refer to the inpatient services costs. High cost imaging is now $150 with no waiver program. The prescription drug deductible increases to $200. The copayment for non-preferred drugs increases to $60 retail or $150 for a three-month supply via Walgreens, UT Pharmacies, or Express Scripts Home Delivery. The plan design changes also include an exciting fertility and family building benefit through Progeny, a leading fertility benefit solution. It's exclusively for UT Select members with at least 12 months of continuous enrollment. The benefit is designed to support all paths to parenthood, removing barriers to care so you and your doctor can create the customized treatment plan that is right for you. All UT Select plan design changes are on page 8 of the Annual Enrollment and Resource Guide. Details about the UT Health Network and progeny fertility benefits are on page 9. A glossary of insurance terms is available in the UT Select plan guide. Plan Design Changes for UT Connect UT Connect is an alternative to UT Select for employees and non-Medicare retirees in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. It's an accountable care organization plan with services offered through Southwestern Health Resources, providers, and facilities. Plan Design Changes for UT Connect, some of which are the same as UT Select, are listed on page 15 of the Annual Enrollment and Resource Guide. Living Well Programs and Services Value-added services offered through Living Well continue next year. That includes Hinge Health, Livongo, and Omada for UT Select members, plus MD Live and Ovia Health for UT Select and UT Connect members. You can also take advantage of two newly launched options both available on the medical plans right now. Learn to Live is a confidential, self-paced online program built on the principles of cognitive behavioral therapy. Their courses on topics like depression, anxiety, and substance use help people learn to understand and overcome their challenging thoughts and feelings. The program is free, available to members ages 13 and up, and offered in English and Spanish. The UT Living Well platform powered by LimeAid is available via web and mobile app for members ages 18 and up. The platform helps you achieve your physical, emotional, financial, and work well-being goals. It offers personalized activities and opportunities to connect with colleagues. To find information about all available wellness programs, visit utbenefits.link slash livingwell. Basic Coverage Package the basic coverage package is covered in full through premium sharing, as described in the medical section. It includes the UT Select medical plan with prescription drug coverage and basic group term life insurance. Thanks to a new contract, the amount of basic group term life insurance in the basic coverage package automatically increases from $6,000 to $10,000. Updates for voluntary plans. There are no plan design or premium rate changes for any of our dental or vision plans this year. You'll find a reduced premium rate for voluntary group term life insurance with no plan design changes. Voluntary group term life coverage rates are based on your age. Because of that, your premium rate bracket may change this year depending on your age as of September 1st. 
Reminders As you prepare for annual enrollment, here are a few reminders. You will be sent the annual enrollment newsletter and an enrollment reminder via email before July 15th. If you do not have an email address on file, you can expect this via U.S. Postal Mail around July 15th. Review your current elections on MyUT Benefits and review information from the Office of Employee Benefits and your HR Benefits Office. Monitor your email for any institutional announcements about virtual or in-person annual enrollment fairs. Some institutions may also post this information on the new UT Living Well platform powered by LimeAid, mentioned earlier in this video. Review your confirmation statement within MyUT Benefits once you enroll, and save or print a copy for your records. The annual enrollment election window closes at 11.59 p.m. on July 31st. Be sure to submit any required evidence of eligibility and evidence of insurability on MyUT Benefits by August 15th. If you don't upload the appropriate documentation by this date, your related benefit changes will not take place. Submit the required evidence of waiver by August 15th if you are waiving the basic coverage package. Expect new ID cards for UT Select, UT Connect, and any new plans elected. Keep your ID cards for any other plans that did not change. Resources The Office of Employee Benefits website is utsystem.edu slash benefits. Find information specific to annual enrollment at utbenefits.link slash AE and visit utbenefits.link slash video library for a variety of benefits videos. For your HR Benefits office, visit utbenefits.link slash HR contacts. Thank you for allowing us to take care of you and your family's benefits. We look forward to being here for you again next year.